Today, we will show you how we've streamlined the setup of the Crosser IQ CTO recanalization system to make this as effortless as possible, all in an average setup time of two minutes or less. Let's begin with setting up the BD recanalization system. To start, remove the BD recanalization system console, foot switch, and power cord from its storage container and mount the console on a five caster IV pole no more than 48 inches or 122 centimeters above the ground. Plug in the power cord to the wall power receptacle. Connect the foot switch to the foot switch receptacle denoted by orange markings and ensure that the red dots on the foot switch connector and receptacle are aligned. Then turn on the console using the switch on the lower right side of the back of the console. The LCD screen will show the BD logo, then quickly transition to Setup and Prime Required Screen. You'll also see the foot switch icon displayed on the LCD screen. Now that the BD recanalization system setup is complete, let's locate the Crosser IQ Ultrasonic CTO device. Remove the tray from the pouch and place the device in the sterile field. Then remove the retainer insert and the Crosser IQ Ultrasonic CTO device from the tray and hand the device power cable and saline spike set over to the non-sterile field. You will then remove cap from Crosser IQ Ultrasonic CTO device saline spike set, spike the saline bag, and prime the spike chamber by squeezing the saline bag. Next, open the pump door and start to feed the saline tubing through the roller pump on the right side of the top and bottom tubing clamps, ensuring there is proper orientation for the saline to flow through, then shut the pump door. Now, connect the Crosser IQ Ultrasonic CTO device power cable to the console power receptacle denoted by green arrows. Make sure that the white arrows on the power cable and power receptacle are aligned. Remove the Crosser IQ ultrasonic CTO device from packaging hoop and remove stylet. Manually flush Crosser IQ ultrasonic CTO device guide wire port with a saline filled syringe and activate the hydrophilic coating on the device by exposing it to saline. Press the flush button on the console until constant flow is observed at the Crosser IQ ultrasonic CTO device tip. The LCD screen will show Priming device, ensure irrigation at tip. It is important to inspect the saline line for bubbles. If bubbles are observed, press the flush button again until bubbles are eradicated. Lastly, perform a system test. To do so, push the on-off on the handle activation button or foot switch, not both, and verify that the irrigation or saline misting is taking place at the distal tip of the crossing catheter for a minimum of three seconds. The LCD screen will also guide you by displaying activate device to perform system test and ensure misting at tip to confirm device function. When the green LED on the Crosser IQ ultrasonic CTO device handle is illuminated and the LCD screen says setup complete, you will have completed the simple plug and play setup of the Crosser IQ CTO recanalization system and are ready to go.